Okay, I've got everything closed up. All the I've got all the um, uh, screens closed up, and and the plastics. And if you calm down here, you'll end up with the head. Head's real cool, actually. It's nice and safe. On passage, under those stairs. Great view out. Arms. Serviced, brand new gas bottles and all compliance with mops, stairs, some storage, and here we keep just toiletries, two cupboards there. Here's the wipe down actually. Easy to get out of, nice and safe actually. And just coming in, um, got the clears closed at the moment, but yeah, coming down the galley, to pay your way into the galley. We've redone all the timber, it's all done in matte uh, polyurethane, low voc or zero voc. Um, three burner stove, which all works great. Oven, nice and clean. We've got um, salt water and fresh water. Uh, here we've got storage. Utensils, and we put a new sink in. This works well. We just take all our washing um, to the sugar steps if we're the sugar scoop if we're at the back of the boat or stern of the boat. Um, do it there. Cupboard space. What's a cupboard space? There should be a light on here. I'll just turn that off. There's a light in there. The lights are off. And then uh, over this side, you have fridge freezer. So that turns into a freezer if you turn it right up or three quarters of the way up. At the moment, it's set up as a fridge just to keep some bits and pieces cool. And then the galley fridge as well. We usually keep our vegetables in here and spare water just in case. That's our backup water. Um, and got. Uh, inverter, control panel, put some new power points on, hot water switch, um, fans, there's fans everywhere, one, two, three, four fans, and then one in the master rebirth. So here you can easily fit four and two, six, two, it's a double here. I think six foot is comfortable. Some storage back there. If you're over above six foot, it might not be comfortable for you. Um, and then the other side as well. So there's another fan and storage. There's a power point here as well. We're thinking about dropping this tail, making it drop down, because that could then become like a day bed. Um, something you could do if you wanted, and then forward, um, some more storage, and another power point and 12 volt charging, usually charge laptops and stuff in here, and then this is the rebirth, um, yeah, we sleep feet forward, um, lots of ventilation, some point there must have been windows there I've seen a photo with windows um, and then we've got some hanging space some drawers same on this side hanging space access to all the bulkheads which are really clean Fan up. It's better. And this side here, just got um, um, 
mosquito nets for all the portholes port and for the hatches. Come forward. It's a real comfy boat. Hatch. Hatch. Hatches get used to come into the boat for sure by the kids. A big hatch forward here as well. And then into the cockpit. Got all the clears closed again today, as I said, and into the head. But as you can see, it's quite a windy day. It must be blowing 15 knots, 20 knots out there at the moment. It's nice, nice and comfortable in here. Also, we find with the clears, if you've got kids with the clears, you can close all this up at night time, even just with the, um, um, with the screens, not the clears. So there's clears and then and screens. We found we just close the screens at night time and then kids want to go to, to the toilet in the middle of the night. They can't, it's safe, it's all closed up. Um, yeah, and then 